Just to start, this was probably one of the fastest and most intense classes I've taken, but also one of my favorites by far. A requirement of this course is to speak of one thing relevant to the course about positive psychology. Narrowing it down was difficult, but I think I got it. For me, the most interesting topics of this course were found in Module 5 and Module 6. I love that Module 5 was about mindfulness and that Module 6 was about compassion. Those are two of the topics that resonate with me most. The topic that I chose to talk about is mindfulness. I wanted to talk about this because I feel like it's something that I was looking for at this point in my life. I've always had a very active brain, but it seemed like it was beyond that. It seemed like it was almost out of my control. Mindfulness seems like it is something that could help me personally. While I always believed that meditation and mindfulness could help people when actually applied, it was really cool to see the effects that they have on the brain, <clears throat> that mindfulness has on the brain. It's something that I would enjoy to be a part of. I would love to be the guinea pig. For a long time now, and especially of recent, I have been hoping that somehow I would be picked for some kind of experiment or research. I would love to have scans and tests done on my brain. When I am not paying mind to what I am doing, it actually seems like my mind is in greater chaos and distress than when I do pay mind to what I am doing. I think just doing what John Kabat-Zinn recommended could help. If I could just realize that I am sitting when I am sitting, it could make a big difference. It seems like a strange concept at first, but most of us need to actively and gently bring ourselves back to where we are in the moment, just focus on what we are doing. I could completely relate when he asked, if when you're taking a shower, if you really are, or if you're at work with 50 coworkers, meaning are you just thinking about work when you're in the shower? And to be honest, I am. It's hard to stop the mind when you're so used to having it focus on everything else other than what you're doing. I would love to be more efficient in school, my workplace, and pretty much just in everyday life. I would also like to be more understanding and patient, and I think mindfulness could help with that. I would also like to use it just to simply pay more mind to what I do and to also help others. I think mindfulness would help me to help others specifically in the field of psychology, which is definitely one of the main reasons I would like to attain it. Or as John Kabat-Zinn said, just be mindful. I would also like to say thank you. I have to say this is one of the best courses I've taken while getting my bachelor's. Thank you for that.